Hello everyone, and welcome back to Game of Thrones, and the last we left off, I'm caught in trouble by saying HELP! Let's see what he needs. Oh God. White Walkers. This looks like the place. <laughs> this is definitely the place. So, who are we dealing with? Someone we can find. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Pit fighters. <laughs> Two go in, one comes out. Day after day. No rules, but That's kill. Anyone who can survive that is capable of anything. They're crazed savages. But one pit fighter is worth any ten cell swords. If you can convince them to fight for you. And that's not going to be easy. Don't expect to charm them or reason with them. If we're very lucky, we'll walk out with our heads. You were a pit fighter. If they're anything like you, we'll be just fine. Understand, they are nothing. I like, like Vesta. These aren't soldiers. She's so tough. They're animals you unleash. <laughs> oh, a goat. Oh, is that diabolical something? Oh, no. Oh, I want a dog. Where's a dog? Where's a dog? Fuck me, the dog's gone. I want to see, look at it. I want to see doggy. Okay. You did what? Must make you feel. What the fuck? Trust me. You don't want to get involved, Basha. I like how Basha's guy does. Is he alive or dead? Dead, I think. <laughs> Got scared. Okay, this is. I'm too scared. Oh, uh, one last thing. They're not fond of strangers. Or anyone who shows weakness. I'll or fear. Lead. Or really any highborn pricks with lily white asses like you, little brother. I can handle this. Oh, after you then. Well, if it isn't best, oh, wait. Um, I have to change my audio thing. God damn it. Um, I'll be back. Back. Um, if you didn't know, um, I put the volume like there's some sort of volume saying that makes it go high, and you can't hear some kids' voices. That's been the problem I've been having. So let's see if we can hear. The okay, fucking basilisk. We just want to talk to Amaya. You don't want to be in here, little man. No, man. You best go back the way you came before I decide to eat you. I'll start with your eyeballs. Fucking juicy when they pop. You sure you have room for me? You seem pretty well fed already. <laughs> My master only ever fed me when I won. I won a lot. Now, you've got to the count of three. To turn around. Wait, where's and that money? Walk have, like, away. One. Two. <laughs> I like this one. You can press the feed. Hey, Abaya! Yeah, Company! I I've been, I've been in this pit fight. Well, not really, but I feel like I have. I feel pretty cool. I feel pretty strong. Is that I feel like I made everyone happy. Yeah, some masters couldn't get enough of the fighting, so they built their own private pits, where things could get really nasty. Yeah, my job. Oh. Oh, back in the world.
That's Amaya. Keep your cock in your pants, little brother. She's likely to chop it off. She reminds me of Michelle's actress or something. Well, hello there. Not That's many amazing. people get past the beast. You need must need something either. very That's badly. Amazing. So, out with it. Before I decide not to let you leave. My name is Asher Forrester. I've traveled all the way from Westeros. I'd suggest you go back there. It's not safe here for outsiders. Amaya, please. Please what? I had a friend once, the Basilisk, but she died a long time ago. I earned my freedom. You walked out on me. On all of us. Fighting side by side, we were goddesses of the pits. You have a problem with her? Deal with me. So, what is it that you want? Why shouldn't we rip you to pieces and feed you to the beast? We're going to stay in at us. My patience wears thin. I need great warriors. My enemies mean to butcher my family in Westeros. They killed my father. They killed my little brother. And now I need great warriors to help me avenge their deaths and reclaim my home. You think we sell swords? We don't fight I'm other people's wars. Because I guess we are pit fighters. Artists who paint in blood. That was yesterday. The fighting pits have been closed. You're all free now. Free to do what you want. Don't you see that? Yes, we are free. Why would we follow another? We don't have masters anymore. Why would we follow anyone ever again? You all excel at combat, but you know nothing until you've tasted the thrill of war. Waves of men crashing together, blood and steel. In Westeros, they sing of our great warriors for thousands of years. Amaya, trust me. You had to He's got it. enough gold for all of you. You want to lead pit fighters? You have to earn their respect first. We don't know who you are until we see you bleed. <laughs> You're gonna have to show them you can fight. All right. Oh. Actually, won't obviously die. Show me your best. Who's the best you've got? His name is Blood Song. He's vicious, he like he's fearless, like and fast. Technology, if you know what I mean. I've never seen him before. Take a good look there. He's the man who's going to kill your boy. And if I beat him, you and your men will join me in my fight. If you can beat Blood Song. You'll gain our respect, but no one has ever beat him. Mm. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. Right. Well, suppose I better get this over with. So what are you supposed to be? With your little like axe? Like your pretty blonde beard? I'd sooner bend you over to fuck than fight you. Thanks for noticing the beard. <laughs> well, come on! Let's see how you die! If I die in there. Yeah? You have a dying wish? This ought to be good. Here's up the way. Will you return to Westeros and kill as many White Hills as you can? No. I'll spend all your gold on the finest of halls. Hey! I need those! You'll fight with the weapons we what, give what, you. Which weapons? You all see this cockless Westerosi? He's come to order us to battle, like our masters yeah, did. I kill no man because another orders me to. I kill a man because it pleases me. Let 
me show you how we dance in Marine. That's lovely. You know why I kill a man? So he's dead and I'm alive. I like Let's get this over with. Choose a weapon um, and try not to die. Um, choices and then they make Only them one of you leaves the pit alive. May the best fighter win! The best would be me! Kill me. Oh, use this! This. E is right, Q is left. I pressed Q on accident. Okay, E is right and Q is left. Is it up That's no weapon worthy of QZ. Uh, Q is left. Q is right. E. Would it help if I stood still? Maybe? Come on, people. Tell you, but that wasn't luck. He's right, he's left. Down. I never had Are you ready? Westerosi? This is gonna hurt! He's right. Yours will be a beautiful death! Isn't that something you'd like to say? Hear that, boy? We cannot let the crowd right. go wanting! I think I can, actually. Wait. Look at this terrified boy! He fears his end! Yeah, she 
Your you're old champion is gone. As are your old masters. You can stay here in Marine with nothing, or you can come with me. I chose you for a reason. I offer you a new life. I offer you all a new life. You well, deserve better you. than this. You deserve more than to die for someone else's entertainment. Fight with me, and it won't just be for sport. You'll fight for a higher purpose. To save well, innocents and murder the guilty. Oh, if you've got the balls to follow me, we will set sail at dawn. And to those too craven to join me, to hell with you! Are we supposed to get back up? Do we just... We have to run. We have to probably jump a ledge or something. Oh god. Yes, we knew her. Oh my gosh. So this, I believe it's Ted's safe. We want to talk to us. Was that, um, killing us with him? Yes, it was. Your Grace. This was tearing us with I think. You're familiar with my brother's chambers, uh, aren't you? Certainly you've been here before. You looked rather confused when you came in, as if you didn't know where you were. Yes, Your Grace. I'd like to think we can be honest with one another. However, you're quite the curiosity, aren't you? <laughs> you made it clear oh your God, loyalty like was with Lady Marjorie, yet now you hardly serve her at all. Have I displeased you, I definitely Your Grace? One. I don't know if I said that. I've heard things. I understand you've been yes. quite busy. Can he leave? He's making me uncomfortable. Tell me, do you consider yourself an honest, loyal handmaiden? One can never tell with you northern girls. Assuming an honest person exists in King's Landing. I try to be. I try to be, Your Grace? Hmm. <laughs> I see. <laughs> I've done my best keep an open oh mind God. about people like you. I love a dress. I Yet. Lucan tells me you've invited yourself to Tommen's coronation at? party. How exactly did that happen? It can't have been easy. 
Or at least it shouldn't have been. I do Wait, what's necessary, Lucan? Your Grace. Including using another girl to talk your way in, I'm told. I like or not above using people to get what you want. I like love her, but I like Good. the evil her. Why would you be so reckless as to risk your neck for what? It all seems rather careless, considering the consequences. My family is still very much at risk, Your Grace. It was crucial I attend. Your family. Sometimes that's a convenient lie we tell no, ourselves. True. When I suspect your issue with Lord Andros played a part in it. You've been such a busy little handmaiden. I assume Lady Marjorie knew nothing of this. No, Your Grace. This wasn't the first time you've hidden the truth from her. You've no qualms about lying to her, have you? Tell me the truth. Your secret is safe with me. I have before, Your Grace. And I would again. You are resourceful, aren't you? Perhaps I mistook your northern stubbornness for please ignorance. Live, but I, I see there's more to you. In cell, You're a cunning girl. And perhaps you can help me. Your Grace? You're quite friendly with my brother Tyrion. I need you to speak with him before the trial begins. I want to know who he intends to call as a witness on his behalf. Consider it a favor to the Crown, for which we will be all pleasure. be grateful. I would be happy to, Your Grace. It won't be easy. Tyrion is devious. Spoilers. Wasn't it, um, Lady You'll have to hide your intentions, otherwise he'll tell you nothing. You may prove to be a useful little Still. bird to me, assuming you do as you're told. Maybe knows nothing about that. In return, I'll take care of your stupid. problem with Lord Andros. But she's, but she's Thank you, Your Grace. It doesn't matter. I never liked the man anyway, and I doubt anyone will miss him. Yeah, so we're going by Tyrion, I guess. That's what we saw in the tree. Well, that's why it's not. Oh, is this a ship? You think we hired this boat for nothing? No, I don't know. That was a rousing speech you gave, little brother. But who knows how much they heard. Bashka, please come. Oh my gosh, you're Billy. After you sold me out to Daenerys, I've given a lot of thought to staying here. Leaving you to your Westeros and your foresters. Thank you. you have? I was angry, but you're my family, no matter what. I'd follow you anywhere, little brother. Just try not to get us killed. Think we'd let you live without us, Westerosi? They say your homeland is fat and prosperous. An orchard ripe for plucking. We'll take what we want and kill anyone who stands in our way. There's no spoils without victory. <laughs> Don't worry about that. Victory is all we know. I'll show them their beds. That's it? Was that like more? Vesco wasn't exaggerating. Malcolm, you're here! And you've found your soldiers. Anrath will be glad of your return. You came through for them. Just as I knew you would. What does Daenerys want from you? She has a mission for me. But beyond that, she's told me nothing. If I can, I'd like to help her reclaim the Iron Throne. Imagine what an ally she'd be to House Forrester yeah, if she Anthony. succeeds. Living here has made a better man of you, nephew. Thank you, Pete. Thank you, Uncle. I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you. You've guided me well. You are your father's son, Asher. For all your differences, he would be proud. Right. So I'll send a raven ahead to Ironrath so. to let Roderick know I you sail for Westeros like with uh, cell swords. Yeah, I think I might keep my choice like this. I really my like thoughts that. will be with you it's in the fight to come. I'll probably change that, but then I have to change everything, so yeah. Asher. Asher. Iron from Iron ice. From Iron from ice. Casting off! Actually, not really 80 anymore. Take this. 
It'll help loosen his tongue. But be careful. He's a tricky little bastard. If he figures out who sent you, he'll tell you nothing. I'll be listening to every word you say. Okay, so he's not going to sign with us. Stupid. Yeah. Oh, I ask for brawn, they send me a handmaiden. Well, you're here. You might as well come in. Let me guess. Your family is in grave danger. And you've come seeking my help? Not that I'd be of much use to you. As you can see, I'm at a bit of a disadvantage. I thought we were friends, Lord Tyrion. I thought so as well. Yet, Did here you are. You brought wine. How thoughtful of you. And you didn't even have to hide it. Hmm. Doesn't smell poisoned. Poisoned? Cersei would love nothing more than to save herself the trouble of a trial. You don't expect me to drink okay. alone, do you? They never let anyone in to see me. Well, and I've grown tired of talking to myself. I suppose I'll have just a little. Ah, true girl of the North. Hmm. Some things are worth dying for. If I fail this, I'm probably going to be dead, so I'm, just, I'm a little bit scared. I really don't want Mio to die. So, um, why are you here? It has to be something good. It's rather unusual for a handmaiden to visit the Black Cells. I've been worried about you, Lord Tyrion. Oh, what have you? you? I should say that. You may be the only person in all of King's Landing who doesn't want to see my head on a spike. You and Podrick. I have to admit, I've always admired your honesty. But I suspect there's more to you than one might imagine. This is all a ruse, isn't it? Sorry? You're coming here. We both know you have an ulterior motive. Does he know? You've come to set me free. It's the perfect plan. No one would suspect it of you. You found me out. Oh, How did you know? Saying? You can learn a great deal about someone if you're paying attention. I, I, I'm really confused a little bit. So, tell me. Cersei sent you, didn't she? I know I'm not wrong. The what truth, Mira. I don't know what you're talking about. She didn't know such thing. The guards have never let anyone in with wine. That was your first mistake. Not that I don't appreciate the gesture. I wish you'd had the courage to tell me oh the God, truth. To tell. Not that I'm above drinking her wine. I told you to be careful. You'll twist your words. Stupid girl. You're acting a fool. Back off, Luke. Back off, Lucan. Watch your tongue, girl. We're not done talking, you imbecile. Give us a moment. Hmm. Imp. Look, and why must you do this? What did my sister expect you would learn? Who will testify on your behalf? I had to say it. She's using you. And will continue to do so. Until you no longer prove useful. I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh, clearly. Which is why you're here. Doing her bidding. And what would Lady Marjorie make of your new friendship with my sister? I doubt she'd be pleased. Assuming she doesn't dismiss you immediately. To be honest, I don't care what Lady Marjorie thinks of me. Hmm. I thought you were smarter than that. Without her protection, you're in a very precarious position. <clears throat> what should I tell Cersei? You're a clever girl. I'm sure you'll think of something. Although, I would suggest you choose your words carefully. Cersei will be far less amused if she catches you in a lie. Please, Lord Tyrion. I beg of you, help me. The only help I can offer is a bit of advice. Become a better liar. Enough of this nonsense! You're wasting my time! Out! Now! 
I wish you well, Lady Mira. Be careful who you trust. Oh my gosh. Mira's dead. She's dead. She's dead. Oh my gosh, she's dead. Oh my god. <laughs> I love this view. It's a picture, obviously. This is stupid. Watch it. What's she doing? What's she leave? Holy shit. Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. Oh, you didn't sleep, did you? Neither did you. They had sex doing. We haven't slept much at all these last few weeks. I'm definitely gonna do most hoping of them naked. I. That actually sounds I hope you don't have any regrets. Them. About this. About us. I've never felt more certain about anything. I'm glad. I oh, wasn't sure if you. <laughs> with all that's happened. Oh, What will we do now? Now that we are... Uh, what we are? We'll be married. And no one will be able to keep us apart. Not Griff, not his father, not Ramsay Snow. I was hoping you'd say that. Roderick? Oh! I'm sorry! I thought you were alone! Good morning, Talia. Oh my gosh, I've Hello, you Elena. Oh! I didn't realize you two were... I mean, I didn't realize she was... It's all right, Talia. Come in. I really am sorry. It's just, Roderick this is urgent, Roderick. Really good. Is that, and like, big piece of pop up? It's, it's all right. I can go. You two need to speak. We'll close next time. I'll see you soon, I hope. I hope they just slay the lane Does look good. I have to admit. All right then, I'm listening. Last night I couldn't. I was having nightmares, so I. Go on, Talia. I went back there. Where? To the grove, and someone was there. What do you mean? Look. It's the maester. It's the maester. This is a report. How many fighting men we have? Where Griff and the White Hill Garrison are being held? It even talks about Elena. Are you both having sex? I know. It's everything. I couldn't believe it. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes... Were you seen, Talia? No. It was dark, but... I yeah. saw him. Talia, I need to know who it was. He's like family, Roderick. But it doesn't matter. He's a traitor. He endangered our house. You have to deal with him like you would Whatever any other man. Is. I'm sure he had his reasons. But no reason is good enough. It's your duty to tell me. And mine oh to pass judgment. I can't stop looking at him. Just promise me you'll kill him, Roderick. Anyone who would betray us like this deserves to done. die. I'm asking you I'll as your lie. sister. I'll probably lie, but... I give you my word, Talia. The traitor will get what he deserves. Now, tell me. Come with me. He's in the you Great Hall. Tell, you can't tell... You can't... You seriously can't tell me? Uh, what kind of sister are you? Oh god, the family portrait's gone. You can only see Ashley. I knew there would be a choice to kill the traitor. I thought of... Maybe there'll be three selection of Mr. Um, Duncan and Savona. Uh, who would you kill to find out, like, a guess of the traitor? Go get the guards. Where is he? Lord, you scared the bloody daylight it's not out. Him. It's the maester. I'm not killing him. What's that? You tell me. 
You don't scare me, Roderick. I've known you since you were a boy. Why, Roiland? Why did you do it? Your father was the greatest lord I've ever known. But you! You've brought this house to ruin! You pushed me to this, Roderick. You brought oh, it upon weapon? yourself. I trusted I you, Roland. With my life. Chah, you'll trust anyone who makes the right noises. You know why? Because you're Bobby weak. Me. You're weak. Just like Ethan was. Making Duncan his sentinel. Ethan was a boy. Ethan was a it fool. Would be cool if it was Duncan. And you've been making fool like, choices too the since the day you crawled off that corpse cart. You've had every opportunity to save this family. But you've squandered them all. Your father would be ashamed. So you turn your cloak! That's your answer! I'm not gonna stand by and watch you destroy this family! You're driving like House Forrester the way of the Starks. The yeah, only thing on. that matters is that you swore an oath to I swore to your father. I'd swear to Asher if he were here. But you're a cripple oh, who can barely hold a sword. Asher knows how to act. Oh, All I you do is limp roll between roll. defeats. Asher would cut your traitor heart out. Oh, I don't doubt it. He has more balls than oh, you ever will. Roderick, it's Griff. He's gone. Somebody set him free. Was this your doing? They were going to ambush you at the trade. I just saved your life. But Ryan... Ryan. How could you? This was his doing! I swear God, Patrick dies. Just sentence me and be done with it. Roderick, you promised. Kill me. And Asher dies too. <gasps> There's one thing that... It was the right thing. He could have probably told us more information, but... What Roiland said. We have to warn Asher. Right. We can't, not if he's at sea. My lord. Wait, so isn't what do we do? God damn it. Prepare the horses. We're going to war! Oh, I like that stick. I'm saying you have a sex project. He seriously has sex ball. We're in the middle of war. Magic, magic. Has he made that hockey buddy? Hey, oh, look at the one for us. You smell that? Oh my gosh. We're almost there, Vesca. Let's have a look. Hey, okay. Come on, break it up! Save your love making for below deck. They listen to you. Barely. But what happens if your lord brother decides he's the one in charge Don't once we're fine. at Ironrath? Do you expect them to follow his orders? Or will it be you commanding them? They don't know him. A lord sounds an awful lot like a master. I'm just another sword. No different than any of you. Roderick is the rightful lord. Trust me, everyone will love him. They'll want to fight for him. Hey, if it's anything like you, well, we'll see. Let's go. Yay! Hmm. That's odd. Port's quiet. No guards. Hardly any ships. Maybe they're all off fighting one of your king's wars. Could be. Well, okay. danger. Maybe we'll have a fight on our hands. I'll let the others know. Right. Aye, aye, Captain. I'm gonna end it here. We have been watching. So, yeah. Part 3 coming soon. I don't know when, but I'll try to put it up soon. Goodbye.